Hello survivors, welcome back to another video. How are you today guys? Let me know in the comments. Today we are back with another reaction video. Of course we are going to react to Giorgio, guy that I have been reacting for a while and I like, I like his videos. I'm waiting for the videos from Vega, but Vega hasn't uploaded in a while. So let's react to this one. Uh, guys, if you have like any more videos that you want me to react to, please comment, comment down below because sometimes I'm looking for these big whales, trying to like find them on YouTube. Um, for me, I don't have any good luck with that. So you might be more active like watching those be those people on YouTube. So let's see here what we got. Uh, I oh okay, let me see the score here first. So they are a little bit up in the score. They have more players, but it doesn't play it out like this sometimes. So let's see, let's see. Let's go, Giorgio, I'm rooting for you. <clears throat> okay, so oh, Giorgio is already 2.1 billion BP. Ooh, how many troops does he have? 10 million troops, 12 million maybe. I have to see. So, oh, okay, yeah, water treatment or solar power. So if you are going there, multiple marches, if the enemy is porting right there. If the enemy is not porting right away, then just, if they are sleeping on buildings, just, just send marches on buildings. Just send marches, yeah, where are they? There Are they even fighting for buildings? Mm, where are they? Same, but if they are not taking... Ah, they are in the center. Ah, guys, look. For me, when all the opposite team gather in the center, for me, it's just the easiest match ever. Especially if you have a super strong player in your alliance like Giorgio. Because what they do is that they are going to call all the rallies from the center. And usually they are going to keep like the weakest, weakest players in the safe zone. So they are going to let you to take all the buildings, but... Because it takes a while for you to fill all the buildings because you are divided into teams, teams. Then if you let them just like call those rallies and those rally hits and they are full because you are still trying to fill buildings because you are divided in teams, then it is going to be tough for you to defend those rallies. So what you have to do, in my opinion, if you are fighting an alliance that it is gathering all the players in the center, you take first occupation buildings, uh, first occupation rewards, because they are going to let you take like the first occupation rewards because they are calling rallies. And then once the rally leaves, because the rally usually have to march like two minutes or like three minutes, depends on the building. You send your two strongest player to the center and you call one minute rallies on random players. Call like four, six rallies on every player because you have six marches so you can keep one march to reinforce a building or to do whatever you want to do but call at least four rallies in uh, to, to random players because they usually are gonna port and if you port those players and those players like get the troops out of the rally those rallies are gonna hit half full and then you are gonna defend and if you defend those attacks man you are gonna have a big gap and you might win the battle just since the beginning because they failed in on taking those buildings. Now, if you don't do that, if you just chill on your building, which is what most alliances usually do, they just chill on the buildings waiting for the rally, they are going to take those buildings because those buildings are not full. And of course, because they are all in the center, there are places strategically that the rally leaders are sending strategically their strongest marches to like the most important buildings and they are going to end up taking the buildings and then because you are spread apart you are going to have troubles like taking those buildings back so if you are fighting an alliance which is all in the center let them call the rallies and like 10 seconds 15 seconds before those rallies like lift port to the center send your two strongest players to the centers and start hammering people Call four rallies on random players and with the other two marches, just send random marches to the people. Because if they port, then those rallies are going to hit half empty. You are going to defend and then you are going to be on Kidori. So that's my opinion. Let's see how they do here. 
Yeah, I, I think like, the, yeah, just state buildings, helipop, the other water treatment, just send marches. Yeah, if you are not doing what I'm telling you to do because you don't know, of course, because I'm reacting to your video, then what you will usually do is what Georgia is doing. Just trying to take those buildings to take the first occupation rewards, which is nice. But remember, in this case, I don't find it a good strategy. I just find a better strategy to go to center and smash those people. Let them call them rallies. And then 10 seconds, 15 seconds, you go there and you start hammering people. Make sure that you call one minute rallies because usually if they are reinforcing each other, they can like hold attacks and they, they are not gonna port. And of course you are gonna even like be in a worse position because you are not gonna be able to defend the attacks. But usually if you come one minute rallies, sometimes they are not gonna be able to take the hit because their main marches are in the rally already. So they are, will have to port and those rally with heal, will, will, uh, will hit half empty and then one more time, you are gonna be in a big advantage. So let's see. Yeah, they are chilling there. I don't recommend this usually, but if like they are strong enough, I, if they defend those attacks, then this is just a, a easy match for them. If they defend all these attacks, then I can tell you that they are gonna win for sure. If they don't defend it, then I cannot say anything. I have to wait and keep watching. So yeah, one minute, yeah, go to center and smash those people, yeah. Call one minute rally on them, so those rallies hit like half, half empty. And here is a good strategy as well, because their rally leaders, all their main marches are out and they cannot recall those marches because they are like marching already. So if you rally them, then you have an advantage and you are gonna be able to burn them all and those players without troops, they are kind of useless. So yeah, that's another point why you should go to the center. So, oh, they lost this one. Let's see the report. Ooh, it wasn't that close. <clears throat> are they, oh, they lose, nah, they are taking the village, you see? <clears throat> yeah, this building wasn't, was that full? Maybe that building wasn't even full? <clears throat> oh, there, no, yeah, ah, yeah, you see? Ah, no, this is getting interesting here. They are losing all the buildings. Yeah, you don't have to let them, like, like hit you full. Go to the center and pour those peoples. Yeah, call one minute rally on them, and they will have to pour because their main marches are out. So you don't wait for the rallies just to hit because when they are in the center, they have the, like, the, the, the opportunity to organize better. And uh, of course, you don't have the opportunity because you are spread apart. So let's see if you take it back. <clears throat> uh, no. Ooh, you lost open. Yeah, open. And, yeah, you have. Uh, yeah, because they, they will have like an advantage because they are closer to the building. Call one minute rally because it is going to take them like a while to reinforce. One minute rally here, one minute to the other building, try to take those buildings back. And when they have to rally again, go to center and smash them. Let those rallies march and then try to pour people. Yeah, call one minute rally, call one minute rally here, try to take those buildings back. And then you readjust and don't sit there just waiting for the rallies. Go to center and make them port. And if you make them port, their wall strategy is going to be like... Uh, crazy and they're not going to be able to to do what they want and you are going to win i'm pretty sure you are going to win so if they didn't reinforce quick he's going to be able to take the building and then yeah just wait for the other rally to hit <clears throat> okay are, they, are you oh they, ah, they lost all the buildings yeah except for water processing four or two. Oh, oh no yeah let's see Oh, yeah, keep him good. Reinforce, reinforce. It was a close one. Yeah, hit that one. Yeah, if this one, if they fail that rally, he should port there and just solo that one because they are going to be low in troops and they are not going to reinforce as quick as if they were closer to the building. So let's see if, they, if Georgia takes the other building. So 19 seconds. If it's a close battle, then just port there, smash that building and take that building back. 
and then just move to another one to take it back and don't wait for them to call the rallies port to the center good move to another building because it is going to take a while till they call a rally again you see they have to call a rally it's going to take time though don't stay there even if your plan is to stay there you have to move to another building because then staying there is not giving you any benefits because you are just waiting for their attacks move to to another building to take another building mm -mm. No, move, move to another one because uh, till another till another rally hits, it's gonna take like three minutes. So those three minutes, you cannot just sit there, just waiting for those solo attacks. You can defend those solo attacks like nothing. Yeah, go to another building. Move, move, Giorgio. <coughs> yeah, yeah, you have to move. Take take the other buildings. Because now the, this is he. Uh, you have to be here. They are gonna take center. They are gonna take munitions, and they are gonna take first occupation. And then the match is gonna be super, super close because they took like a lot of first occupation. But now they are gonna just like get it back while taking munitions center because they are all in the center. So yeah, I, I wouldn't be just waiting here for another rally. I will move to water the process like to water treatment two or one, which is the opposite side and try to take those buildings. You cannot just sit there waiting for their attack to defend. You already know they're gonna pick your stats because you were full and they took the building. So yeah, I don't find in that cool strategy just to sit there waiting for rallies. <clears throat> yeah, you should move to another one. And even if your strategy is just to be in that building, you have to change as you are thinking like the things are not working out. Move to another building, take those and then let them like call rallies and go to center and smash them yeah you see they are calling rallies just a perfect time and uh, now you are late because now you have to wait uh yeah that's what you have to do yeah but now you already let them call the rally you should have moved before to take the other buildings yeah, good. To smash that player. That player is going to port. It will have to port or you will zero him and then just a player with less troops. Yeah, smash it. Yeah, keep, keep keep smashing that player because they are not reinforcing. Don't let them reinforce. Ah, now it's a mess. They are There is a, a rally already marching to the other building. They are going to lose the building. They are taking center. They are taking munitions. Same, uh, yeah. Ah, send two munitions at least. Secure munitions to take first occupation there. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. You see, they already have a rally of munition there. Yeah, you don't let them. Don't, don't let them. If you are all in centers uh, and you let them play them, their game, then it's just going to be crazy. Yeah, reinforce munition. Good. <clears throat> yeah, but you you are gonna lose the other building. Yeah, you see? Yeah, that rally was marching there. Ah, you have to you have to get those buildings back. Let them in center. Ah, you lost the rally. Yeah, move. Move to move to water treatment one, which is this one. Yeah. You have to move to water treatment one, this one, and take those buildings back. And then when they are trying to reset those, you go to center and smash them. So, yeah. Uh, no, because you are going to lose that one. There is a stronger player there. That rally is not going to win if that building is full. You see, now they are cashing up. They are cashing up. <clears throat> yeah. Now you see all that player good, but they are, no, they are not porting away. They are like, no, we stay here. Yeah, because they are winning. You let them. You let them like do their thing. You don't have to let them do their thing because now they are just like, oh, we are controlling the buildings. We are just chilling here. Hold, guys. Hold, hold, hold. Because now they don't know what to do. And yeah, you are going crazy here. Wow. Mmm, fail. Nice. No, you are losing. The, uh, you took it. Yeah, reinforce quick. Reinforce quick. Mm. 
Yeah, somebody has to take care of the other buildings. If you don't take care of the other buildings, you're going to lose because they are already cashing up. Look at 3,000 against 1,000. Someone has to make them port. Someone have, has to make them port there because they are easily calling rallies and resetting buildings and you shouldn't let them do that. Yeah. Mm, yeah, they need to reset these ones. Water treatment 2 and the water, deprocess water processing 2. They have to reset those. Mm. Yeah. Ooh, they lost def compound. Nah, no, you have to you have to to reset the other ones. You cannot just be fighting for one building in the center because they are gonna stay in the center, and for you it's easier to reset the other ones. Once you reset the other ones, then you go to center and make a chaos there because if you make a chaos there, then it's gonna be easier for you. So yeah, uh, it's good that you are boarding them. It's good, but you are not like taking care of the other buildings. There are the strategy is just hold, hold here because we are taking care of the building. So, uh, you see, you don't have marches now to reinforce. No, you are wasting too much time there. Hmm. Ah, you see, you fell. I told you you were going to fail that rally because they have a strong player there. You have to reset water treatment one at two because it's easier for you than center. They are there in center, reinforcing quick, calling rally super, super quick. And they, they can't even let you to take center, but it doesn't matter if you take center because they are taking the most of the buildings. Def compound is a bad idea. You get more water per minute. Uh, taking care of water treatment one and two so you have to go there and reset yeah you lost center now go go to reset the other ones because it is going to take them a while to reinforce to take care of those buildings to take them back because they have to call rallies for center so you have an advantage in the other buildings you don't have an advantage in the center because the wall alliance is in the center now you are wasting time there now now they they, they have uh, the water tanks and um, I think they have a great plan for the water tanks as well. And then you are really going to be screwed. No, go. Forget about center. For you, it's easier to go to. <clears throat> no. Wow, they are, they are already, they, they already catch up. Yeah, they are winning now. Look at, they are now taking the other building, water to process, processing four. Hmm. No, I think you are wasting too much time in center when you should be. Yeah, you see, they are even taking a long time to reinforce those buildings. That building is low in troops. You can just go there and smash that building and take it back. Yeah. Yeah. Fighting for center is not a good idea. The the wall alliance is in the center. You lost another building. No, no, no. Go, go, go to take the other ones. Ah, no. You are letting them play their the game. Yeah. Mm. No, you have to go to the. Same. I, I I think like so many rally leaders, they lose so much time in center. Our rally leader does that as well. They see center like this main building and they cannot like let it go. So and the other buildings which are easier for you to take, then you don't take advantage of those. So, yeah, you have to make sure to take advantage because now you are not resetting anything. You are not gaining points because you are waiting to take control of center. And they have been holding the buildings for a while. So they're accumulating points. And look at this. Now there are 10,000 points like above you. And of course, they're going to take center super quick because the wall alliance is in the center. You have to fight for the other ones. It's going to be easier for you to go to reset these two water treatment 
2 and water processing 2. No. And then reset them because it's going to take them a while to call rallies. You move to the other two, reset those. And then if you want to go to center, it's a perfect time. But don't go to center to take center. Go to smash the wall alliance and you will make them port and then you will create a chaos there. But yeah, now I think it's too late already. So I think it's too late. I think they already put you on the spot and you are the one in chaos. You don't know what to do. And now they are occupying all the buildings. So yeah. Yeah, 16,000. They are holding most of the water tanks, I guess. Mm. No. Yeah, you see that player ported, but you should have done that after taking the other building. So the rally hits half full. Yeah, you see they are porting, which is good. But now if they are porting, it means that the, that the other buildings are low in troops. So you cannot just be in center there waiting to take center. You have to move to the water processing one, uh, plant one, water treatment one and two, because now they are porting and those buildings are for sure lower in troops because their troops were there. So you go there and you call rallies. It's going to take them a while to reinforce those buildings. And then I'm pretty sure you are going to get, you know, into a good position again. But now just wasting time in center doesn't make any sense. Ah, <clears throat> Yeah, you see, you, you took the building. They are ready to call a rally super quick. And for them, they can keep doing this forever because they are occupying the other buildings. Oh, you have to move there. You have to move. They already have an advantage that they are like taking care of the building and their main the, their main marches are there. So you are gonna hit. They are gonna see that you are calling the rally. Your rally is gonna take a while to march. The same distance that they have to march, they have to march as well. Then you have to speed up a little bit, refill those buildings because they are gonna see that you are calling the rallies. And then of course they are gonna defend the attacks. You are gonna be in the same position, no gaining points, just losing. Now they are almost 100,000, you are 60,000. So yeah, yeah, I told you. Mm. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, you lost center. No, no. <sighs> forget about center, forget about center. You have to reset the other buildings. Look at... <laughs> Ah, you have nine million. They are playing with you. They are, they are sending you one minute, one, one um, how do you call it? One, one troops marches because they know they are, they are waiting. They are bullying you. Come on, don't let them do that to you. Yeah, but you are fighting for the buildings that are no important death compounds there is a guy or someone resetting this comp death compounds you have to go reset the water treatment two and one and water processing one and two because those those give you more water points per minute mm. uh, let's see Now you should try to make them port because if you have, ah, you failed that rally. You should try to make them port at least because now if you make them port again, maybe you might have the other buildings that you are attacking. You are calling rallies too, a little bit lower in troops. And even if the guy beat you on the stats, then you are gonna be able to take the building back because it is lower in troops. So try to make them port at least. Same random marches to the players around and then just hope to take the buildings. If you don't take those buildings, then you are gonna lose 100%. Even if there's just 30 minutes left into the match, I'm pretty sure you are gonna lose, especially if you don't change the strategy. Yeah, you see, they are calling rally at rallies. For them, it's easy. They can do this the whole night. Yeah, you fail the rallies. You see, you, you get them time. You have move, solo those buildings. They are low in troops, move to one, solo that building. Move to the other ones, solo that building, take them back, move to the other ones, take those back, and then move to center. Ah, come on, Giorgio. Wow. Yeah, those beetles are low in troops. Someone should be there 
solo in those buildings. There are low in troops and infantry, so yeah, you could take those buildings after six marches. You send six marches, take it back, wait for reinforcement, take the other one, and then move to the other water treatment and take those and then move to center if you want, but nah. No, nah, this is a lost match already. Yeah, go solo that build. No, solo, that's slowing troops. If you call from the center, they are just gonna reinforce. <laughs> you, you, you give them time to reinforce, like 10 minutes to reinforce. Of course, those buildings are gonna be full with the same stats and you are gonna run into a wall again. You see 500 here, you can move. Yeah, this is center. Oh, oh yeah, it's not, there was another rally. That building is slowing troop as well. Wow. For me, this was an easy match to win, especially the first like minutes of the of the of the match were super important. I think you should have gone to center and smashed the crap out of them, calling one minute rally, marches and stuff. Some players would have ported it, you could have holded those buildings and then it's a big advantage. But now look at this, they they just like my god. Yeah, they are reinforcing those buildings, filling them up. Look at this. The marches are going. So you are going to run into the same wall now because you cannot beat the guys in the stats. So the only um, the only way to beat them is just to, to, to have the buildings lower in troops. And for that, uh, you had it. Oh, look at this. They are, yeah, I told you that their strategy for water tanks were great because when you are in the center, you have a great strategy if they like let you let you do that wow my computer is running out of space guys i don't think that i'm gonna be able to react to the wall mash but i'm pretty sure they are gonna lose there is no way that if they keep playing like this they are gonna get uh, like an advantage yeah, because now it's just a matter of who is taking center. Now this reservoir ray for him turns into a capital and trying to take center, trying to take center. And um, meanwhile, they are occupying the other building. So yeah, yeah. One player ported, which is good. Might be that the other buildings are lowering troops. Let's see if he takes those buildings back. I don't think it's just one player. So. Yeah, try to make that one port. Hmm. Okay. Uh -huh. You took one. The other one. Yeah, you took one because. Yeah, this one was lower in troop the whole time. I told you, you could have solo those buildings like, I don't know, one year ago. Yeah, if they didn't reinforce the building, yeah, uh, you, yeah, you took the other one. Good. Yeah, they are low in troops. Yeah, you should have. Now you have to move to the water treatment one and two because if they are porting here, those buildings are lower in troops as well. So you could even solo those buildings at this point. And then once you take them, because they have to readjust calling rallies, then for you it's easier to go to center and smash them. You don't let them call those rallies. You don't let them fill those rallies and they are going to be screwed. Now they are playing their game. Um, it's working out pretty well. Mm. Wow. Yeah, but. Yeah, the, the one minute rallies are good, but once you take care of the buildings, if if you are losing by a long shot, then taking one calling one minute rally is not gonna make a big difference. So yeah. Now this eight thousand against one thousand. <laughs> there is no way. Hmm. Nice. Yeah. Now look, they are already calling rallies. Mm. 
Yeah. Five for center when the wall alliance is in the center since the beginning. Five for the center is a disadvantage. You have your advantage is on the other buildings around because it takes more time to 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 refill those buildings and stuff. So yeah, those are good hits. But one more time, you do that after like taking care of the main like piece of the cake. You know the, the most of the buildings. Now losing the buildings. If you wanna have fun, of course you can do that. Cold rallies. But if you want to win one more time, that I'm always assuming players want to win, then yeah, buildings and then the rallies. Mm. Yeah, what, what they are doing now is what they should have done in the beginning, smash them. They port away those rally instead of 1.2 million, they hit with 800, 900 troops. You defend all the attacks, they have to readjust. Their strategy was being in the center, then everybody just spread apart. They don't know what to do. It's going to take them a while to, let's say, just readjust. And then meanwhile, you are just gaining points. But now then it didn't happen, they are, you know, in an advantage. So they are just gaining points. And of course, now you don't know what to do. You are like, wow, center uh, born players. What should I do? But it's too late already. So they are, they have doubled the points. Yeah, now have fun, have fun. If I was you, I would be having fun. And you are going to lose the building. They have another rally going, I guess. Yeah, just have fun. Smash those players. Go port there and just smash the crap out of them. You are not winning. Yeah, port here, here. No, no, port here and smash them, Giorgio. Come on, Giorgio. You are not you are not winning anymore. Come on. You see? Yeah, our a rally's going. Yeah, you have a rally going. Nice. Yeah, let's see. But now next next time pour here. No, 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 no. Pour. Pour close to them. I smash them. Good. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, now it's all about fun. I don't care. I, you already lost. But now just go there and pour there and smash them. <laughs> now they are born in that plasma four. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Ah, now you are going crazy. Yeah, go, go, go. Right on the shot. Yeah, go. Port there and. Yeah, you lost that one. Yeah. It's... yeah. Murder them. Port close, Georgia. Come on. Don't be shy. Forget about the buildings. It's not why you are winning. Forget about the buildings. You just pour there and murder people. Uh. Yeah. Boom. Nice. Yeah, that play is zero since the beginning. Uh, one minute rally, go, yeah, <laughs> burning, yeah, burning all, burning all, forget about the buildings, you are losing. Now they might just go crazy as well, now they might just go around because they know they are winning, so, yeah. You see, if you, now they, they have trouble, like, uh, taking the buildings, for example, center, because now they are running, they are just, like, out of, like, their strategy because players are porting, you could have done that in the beginning, yeah, it would have been better. So now just smash them all. Go. Call one minute rally to another player. Uh, nice. Let's see. 
Where are you happy? I burned that player. About burning all. Look at this. Boom. Oh, he defended the attack. Ah, it was a solo. I thought it was a rally. Port there and smash those people. Yeah, now they are going crazy. They know they are winning. Now they are even warning your players. Ooh, nice. Nice. Ah, poor closer, please. I want to see you burning people. Poor here, here. And then just call four rallies to those random players there. Yeah, come on, do it, do it. Do it, please, do it. Yeah, Porter close. Why are you doing <laughs> Seriously, I want to... Uh, uh, look at this. Boom. Yeah, port closer and burn them all. Yeah, now they are going crazy. Yeah. Ah, you are still there. Sometimes I don't I, I don't understand like spenders. Sometimes they go crazy when they don't have to go crazy. Uh, they rally your teammate and they burn him. And when they have to go crazy like now, they are like, oh no, let's take buildings, let's occupy buildings, let's just say, yeah, go there, go, boom, so boom, 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 go, yeah, my God, seriously, you are sleeping there, Giorgio. Sorry, Giorgio. You know that when you have to receive love, I give you love. I have to be tough on you. I be, I be tough on you. Burning all. You see, now they are porting. That's what you should have done, Giorgio, since the beginning. Ah, come on. Yeah, more than yeah. Go, 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 go crazy. Zero yourself. Zero yourself here. Go. Yeah, go crazy. You see, you should have done this in the beginning. Next time, I want to see you doing this in the beginning, and then they are screwed because those rallies hit. Look at this. They are dead. Go. <laughs> Yeah, go zero them. Yeah, nice. Go. Yeah, this is this. Look at this. He's attacking you. Wait till he sees the report. Seven million troops. Yeah, let's see how many troops he has. Uh, attack fail. You fail that attack, right? See? Yeah, your yeah PB. PB, PB, oh no, but you won. Yeah, you see, now there is this a chaos. This is the chaos you should have created in the beginning. Now you see, they are just porting away. Now you could even go to the buildings and solo those buildings, and those buildings are gonna be without troops. You can solo those buildings easily now if you want, but uh, yeah, it's too late anyways. You see, now they are taking the buildings. Yeah, you could go to those buildings and solo in and super, super easy. Yeah, smash that player. Smash it, smash it. Yeah, that one. Six march. You see, you see, they are neutral now. You see, they are low in troops. I told you, you could have done this in the beginning. I, I told you, oh my God, should I be an expert in a state of survival? Look at this. This is the cow you have to create in the beginning. Boom. In the beginning, you created this cows. Those really hit half full. You defend it. Good have been another story. Look at this. Now you are just taking those buildings super easily back and the, the thing is that they cannot call rallies because now that they don't have troops so in the beginning that would have been fun that's too late yeah go go there go georgia go yeah more than yeah that player has zero troops he's sending troops out nice now this one is neutral, you see there, are, ah. yeah, you see there, now it's for, you see, it's easier for you to take buildings, you are now taking a lot of buildings because they are porting away, and because they were all in the center, if they port away, the troops are gone from the building, so now, it's just easier to take them, you can go to, go to the buildings and solo those buildings to, to kill extra troops, go to this one, and to water treatment one and two, and you are gonna just take them super, super quick. That that player is zero since like since the beginning of the match you zero that player. That player doesn't have any troops. Unless he, he